So hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. So I wanted to come on today to um, show you guys some candy bouquets that I am working on. So this is um, one of the candy bouquets. I had showed you guys that I had gotten a long, um, one of the long Twix boxes uh, after Christmas. Uh, I got two of them actually. And so there's like 18 of the these size Twix in there. And so I was going to use those to make some candy bouquets. So this is um, the candy bouquet that I uh, made. And I'm going to make, um, I'm actually going to make three more of them. I may make a few more, but um, this is what I'm going to do uh, right now. So this is the, if you go to Dollar Tree, they have three sizes of this, these boxes right here. Um, this is the middle one. This is not the real large one, nor the real small one. This is the small one. You guys can see. And this is the medium size one. So this is the medium size. And it, it actually worked really well for these candy bouquets. So I went back and got uh, three more um, at this mid medium size so that I could do these uh, candy bouquets. So what I did was I went and got some of these uh, little uh, floor blocks. And this is the four pack of floor blocks. And I got these because they actually fit in here really, really well. And I'm gonna show you, as you can see, um, three of them fit pretty much uh, perfectly side by side. Um, it does go all the way down. You can actually put one up under there this way if you want uh, under there like this and then put these up and it'll lift them up um, if you want to. That's what I did with that one. But I really don't think I'm going to need um, that but just because of the fact that these sticks are so long. So I'm going to see if this will work because... Um, this this is so long and i think with the last one in the back i actually ended up using two popsicle sticks uh stuck together anyway so um i probably won't need to lift it up like i did with this um so what i what i'm using in these is four of these large size tweaks and six of the small size tweaks and i put the big ones on the um large popsicle sticks and these are on the skewers and I just cut a long skewer these here I cut these in half and that's what these are on so we're going to go ahead and get started and um let's go so basically I just start from the back a little bit.
I am putting this on another popsicle stick to make it longer so it will adjust right. So this is what we have so far. I'm going to fix this because this needs to be a little higher and that needs to be a little lower. And you just basically adjust them as you need to. And um, just to make sure that they're, you know, proportioned properly. And what I did uh, was, let me see, where's my, I got one of my little heart sticks and I stuck it in the front. Just right there. And then I have some of the uh, balloons that I got from Timu, which is these right here. And all I did with these was I um, put them on uh, the skewers. Yeah, let me find my glue stick. Or my um, glue dots, excuse me, these. So I glue dotted it in the middle so that it would wrap around the skewer. And then I hot glued it. And I just kind of put it right there to the top. Um, and to be careful that you don't um, stick it into the balloon. And you can either, you can actually use tape if you don't want to use um uh, hot glue so you can actually just tape it on there so like that and then glue dot it in the middle like I said so the stick will hold to it you can actually and they do sell sticks to come with these but I just thought that this was a, a easy um alternative um to just kind of so now that's stuck on there with the glue dot and I'm just going to secure it with a piece of um, tape and just wrap it around like that and then when I put them in I always put it to where this part right here is in the back and so I'm going to and I'm probably I'm gonna have to break it so let's see break it down here at the bottom Make it just a little bit more. And I'm doing it at kind of an angle. Okay. And I can bring my little twigs down just a little bit. Okay. And then I'm going to break this stick. About right there. Let's see. Looks like I need to scoop this up a little bit. Okay. So that's the way it looks so far. And then what I used was, let me get it. I always forget something, y'all. I told you that. <laughs> Hold on. So I used these. I got um like, I think three of these from the Dollar Tree. So um this is what I'm using as my little centerpiece right here. And um, I just find one that looks pretty close to the design that's there. And I'm going to cut it off. And basically, all I'm going to do is I'm going to use two popsicle sticks um, and glue it to that. And that's going to be how I'm going to put it in the...
So I have my centerpiece here. I'm gonna put it in here. And I'm just gonna put it in here behind my last twigs, like so. And then I'm gonna push my twigs down just a little bit, if I can, if it'll let me, hold on. It wants to be difficult, go down. I might need to break this stick just a little bit. Break it just a tad. Because it's just a little bit too high or higher than what I want. Let's see. There we go. Okay. glue dot this to the back of this tweaks so that it'll stay like I want it to stay. Get on there. There we go. Okay. I'm going to do the same thing with this one over here. Just so the little act right. And then what I've been doing is, I think this is pretty much kind of like what I wanted to um, give it a little more embellishment. I have these um, that I bought from, I bought them actually for another project, but I ended up not using that project. So these are some of the little cellophane sheets. Um, I ordered those. I ordered some from Amazon and I ordered some from Timu. And so this is what I've been using. Um, if I can find them. Where are they? Okay, there Okay. These, um, and so I cut them up into fours. And if you can see in the front of this, this is what I've been doing is using the little cellophane sheets and the embellishments. And then in the back, I've been using just my tissue paper just to kind of give it a cover so you can cover the mechanics of the um, of the candy bouquet. And so that's what I've been doing. And I also use one of my little bitty balloons. This is one of the little two inch balloons that you can blow up and that's optional. Or you can actually use something else. You can use one of these or something else. But for this particular one, I use one of these little um valentine balloons and i don't know if i have another one some of them were acting right and some of them weren't but i do have um and i also have some of the other ones uh these little balloons here to go up here that i may use i'm not going to use them for the twix because it really don't match my color scheme um but um i do have a, a different kind of this balloon as well so yeah so this is kind of my candy bouquet um and this is my finished look. Now, I'm not going to put the little uh, embellishments in here. Like I said, basically all I do with these is I fold them this way and then I fold them again. And I put, I you can either high glue them straight to the box, which is what I've been doing sometimes, is um, I'll glue it in the middle so it'll stay. And then I kind of get it and just glue it to the box like that. Or you can um, put it on a skewer. So it just kind of depends on what what you want to do. But a lot of times it, um, it's easier for me that I can just um, fold it twice. And that's why I cut them. So I can just fold it like this and then fold it like that. I put a little glue in the middle so it'll stay together. Just a dot, just a dot. And then I put another little dot here and I'll just stick it straight to my box in there. I got a little embellishment, if you can see. And so that's basically what I do. Um, 
to kind of give it a little flare and um and then like i said in the back i do the same thing with the um these sheets i um fold them this way and then i fold them again and i put me a little glue in the middle so they'll stay together put a little glue right here and just kind of go through here uh oh just kind of go through here and put put it wherever i think it, it needs to go to cover up you know the mechanics in the back of the bag and i start at the bottom and just kind of work my way up and this is kind of what it looks like once you're done but anyway i just wanted to come on here and show you guys and this is of course another little pool bowl just one of my little bitty ones that i stuck and i glued hot glued it to the front of the box um to kind of give it a little just a little extra but i think it came out really cute um, I'm like I said, I'm gonna do um four of these for now. I do have another box of the Twix. I haven't decided whether I'm gonna do um go ahead and do the other box of Twix or if I'm gonna do something else with it. Um, but this is what I'm gonna do for now, and I'm gonna finish these up off camera and um get get on to the next project. So thank you guys so much for watching. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye guys.